I know how to get things done. While he's never served in elected office, R.J. Neary says his experience in real estate development and on the Omaha Planning Board will allow him to immediately start fixing Omaha's affordable housing problem. We need to make use of the existing housing we have and, and, and make sure it's not substandard, that it's uh, stabilized, clean, safe. Neary says he's looking to add housing inspectors and change the inspection law passed a few years ago so it does not penalize the good landlords. I would like to simplify it and, and work towards four or five years changing it, but we got to solve the problem. Let's use what we got. Let's hire the right number of inspectors. It's probably two or three more inspectors, making it more efficient. Neary also has an eye towards the future in transportation, saying he'd intensely look into adding a streetcar and making sure the city bus system is more robust, saying it's something people seeking jobs are looking for. Connect our city to all parts because we have a lot of people that can't get to the jobs in Southwest Omaha because the transit, it takes too long and it's cumbersome. Neary also says he hears from voters that the streets, that the buses and other vehicles use are crumbling. He believes if we use the right companies, materials and design, it would end the cycle all Omahans are familiar with. It's the pothole patch, pothole patch circle that we've all lived in. Neary, a Democrat, also says he wants to think differently on policing, saying the Omaha Police Department has largely done a great job, but has had some major issues dealing with use of force. He says he wants to bring innovation to the department, adding in a social services element that he says is not there now. One example he cites is a man he saw experiencing homelessness downtown. Well, that's a perfect social services call right there. Um, it wasn't unsafe. The person needed to get somewhere, though, and get off our streets and, and get in a safe spot. In regards to COVID, Neary says he would listen to the experts, like here at UNMC, for items like the mask mandate. He'd also seek to hire a COVID czar to coordinate a recovery. And finally, he'd put 5% of the city's restaurant tax towards the Omaha's Convention and Visitors Bureau. Let's jumpstart. Let's not just wait and see what happens. Let's have a plan and move forward.